to this arena does or does not bring to the table of politics. I really don't know. I'm going to leave that all up to the pundits who all say, yeah, would it be the same influence as a book club? and the hype, I understand the difference between a book club and free refrigerators. That was a nice refrigerator. I understand the difference between that and this critical moment in our nation's history. And so, and so I made, yes I did, same reason you did, because I care about this country. And as we were driving in here today, I said, uh, you have to care about this country to come out in this kind of weather. 12 degrees, freezing rain and snow, you love America. I can see that. with honor, with compassion, 
and with an unyielding focus on what we all can do together to make this nation the future that we all deserve. He knows he cannot do that alone. So this is not a time for any of us to shrink away from a new bold path for our country. We can all look around us, and as you look around you, you can be sure that we don't just want to reinvent the same reality that we are now all experiencing. We have to stand strong and united for the potential, the potential within us and the potential that lies before us. No, I've never done this before. And it feels like I'm, I'm out of my queue, I'm out of my terrain. same things over and over and over again, I know that you get the same results. Yeah. So what I believe is that it's time for us all to let's dream America anew again by supporting Barack Obama. Yeah. You know, in my private conversations with friends, when we're not discussing who's winning Dancing with the Stars. <laughs> we talk about more serious things and we, we shake our heads and we say, mm -mm -mm. somebody ought to do something about the dismal state of so many of our schools. The dismal state of so many of our schools that don't serve the genius of our children. and future for leaders in schools that continue to fall behind. We shake our heads and we say, mm -mm -mm, somebody ought to do something about that. We say, how in this great country can we have people who have to file for bankruptcy just because somebody in their house got sick and there was no health insurance? truth. 